Hi my loves and welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can tell by the title, we will be working with Love Win Hair. So thank you so much to Love Win Hair for sponsoring today's video. So they sent me over this kinky straight bob 4C edge wig. And this wig is a frontal and as you guys can see this wig as I've just said has 4C edges So that is one of the main details of this wig that I was really trying to show you guys in this video Also in this install I will be doing this completely no glue and no spray So you guys can definitely wear this wig glueless if you would like so the first thing we're going to do is just add some makeup to the lace because I did not bleach the knots on this wig. I literally just took it out of the box and I just added some powder to my lace so it can blend in a little bit more. Because this wig comes with an adjustable strap and as well a grip material in the back of this wig, it actually gave me a lot of support on my head and it really made the wig feel tight. And that was one of the main reasons why I did not use any glue or any spray because my wig really did feel secure. So once again, I'm just showing you guys up close the 4C edge on this wig so now we're just gonna start to install so I'm just gonna cut off my lace by my ears and I'm just gonna cut off all the lace surrounding my forehead as well In the later clips, as you guys see me cutting off my lace with this razor, you guys are also going to see me cut a little bit of the edges as well. Because I just felt like some of the edges were a little too long for my liking, so I just took my razor and I just tried to like trim it a little bit because I really wanted this wig to give very much natural. After cutting off the lace, I am now going to start parting my hair in sections and using my hot comb and my wax stick to kind of flatten out this wig at the root. Because this wig is in a kinky straight texture, this texture is kind of like a natural blowout. So it is kind of going to give you that like puffy look to it. I really wanted to keep that look to it as well. I really didn't want to make it like too bone straight. So I'm just going to take my, my hot comb in certain sections and try to get this as flat in certain areas, but just not too flat. I still wanted it to give the natural kinky straight look. Thank you. 
So now I'm going to start flat ironing this hair. So I'm just going to use my flat iron um, and just straighten out this whole wig. And later on in the video, I ended up doing a little bit of curls as well. So I'm just going to use my flat iron to first straightening it and then add some curls as well. Also, because I didn't use any adhesive with this wig, you guys may see my wig, you know, kind of lifting in certain areas because I obviously didn't use any spray. But if you guys would like, you can also wear this wig with glue or without glue so that's one of the best things about having glueless wigs because if you prefer glue you can wear glue and if you prefer glueless wigs you can also do that as well also i noticed that this wig came in like an asymmetrical cut bob and i didn't notice it until like i started straightening the hair so i kind of wasn't a fan of that using my scissors to kind of make it even on both sides because i didn't realize it was kind of cut asymmetrical so yeah um so i'm just gonna flat iron my whole head like i said and then i'm gonna curl it and cut some layers in the front and kind of add a little bit of something you know try to give this hair a little more life Do y'all see this lace? It blends in so, so well. And I didn't even bleach the knots. Like, it looks so good. That was everything for this video. I thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you guys would like to purchase this wig, do not forget to check my description box down below. I love you guys so much. And I will see y'all in my next video.